let's now take a look at how to add and organize our favorite web pages on the browser. To get to the favorites, just click on the star at the top right. Make sure you have the favorites tab selected at the top. I'm going to click this icon here to lock the favorites menu to the left side of the browser. The favorites menu gives you the option to organize your favorites in the folders. If you would like to add a site to your favorites menu, just navigate to the site and then click on the add to favorites button. In the window that opens, we can choose to change the name and the location where we are going to save it. I'm going to shorten the name of this site to just CNET. For this website, I would also like to create a new folder that is more related to the website. To do that, just click the new folder button. I'm going to call this folder tech and I'm going to create it in the favorites folder. Then click create to make the folder and then click Add. Now you can see that the folder called Tech has been created. And when I click on it, you can see the website that I just added. If I want to better organize my favorites, click the small arrow at the top and choose Organize Favorites. From here, we can choose to create a new folder or move, rename, and delete a folder. When you are done organizing, click Close. While we are in here, let's take a look at the History tab. This is where we can look at the websites that you have previously viewed. You can sort the websites by clicking the drop down list at the top and choosing one of the options. One last thing that I would like to show you is where your computer saves all of your favorites. To get to them, go down to the Start menu and then up to your user folder. Then click on the folder called Favorites. This is where your internet browser will save all of your favorite websites. If you want to move the folder to a new computer, all you will need to do is copy the contents of this folder and place it into the Favorites folder on the new computer. I will show you how to do this in an upcoming video. In the next video, we will take a look at how to delete your browsing history and change browser settings.